A little bit of confusion with the button hitting. A little bit of confusion with the button hitting. <sighs> Whatever. Um, it's a uh, 1.30 and some of you have uh, showed up to uh, watch this madness uh, of playing this retro console. So this is, we, we did a review actually, the video came out this morning. The video came out this morning. And it was in regards to this. Basically, it's a. Uh, at first, I thought it was a console in a controller, but it's a console on a memory stick full of ROMs that's inside a little HDMI stick. Now, a few things to kind of be aware since I've been playing with this thing for the past uh, probably close to, I don't know, four or five days for sure. Um, first thing is. Uh, shows up it's a 720p device so i wasn't sure what the resolution was when it got out here 720p is fine because these games were you know produced uh probably 640 by 480 some of them may even have been produced even lower 320 by 240 possibly um but uh, i'm gonna bring up the screen here just so you guys can see it transit there it is so this is the main screen that would come up when you uh, boot into it. It starts up like instantaneously, which is nice. Now, a few things. There's a few things that I like, a few things that I don't like right off the, the bat. And I think this video is going to be fairly short, all depending on how many of you out there actually are <laughs> feel like watching this. Um, when I went in, firstly, I was like, okay, it says 4,700 plus games. So to get in here just so you guys again can see this right there's basically a like a start to select button here uh the start button kind of goes is like an enter button and the select button is a back out button so let's say you're in sports and you click loads in the top right hand corner you guys can see it there it says it's one out of 254 cool right and you can kind of scroll through now number one is up and down takes you up and down through the menu system here awesome and uh, I'm not sure how many you get on each screen let's see 10 so you're looking at and what I don't like too maybe it's a hundred what I don't like as well is that uh, you can't go the other way through so for instance when you get up to here which it will probably be oh no this is just gonna go through all of them. Um, but you can't go up to number one and push up and go to the bottom so if you're looking at getting to the bottom of the list you gotta go through them all which I don't I don't necessarily like because as you'll see here I'll get all the way back up to one right and you can't kind of force yourself at the bottom so if you want to play something that starts with Z or Y then you're kind of out of luck now if you back out of here that was 200 games right you go to shooters enter into this you know you're looking at 90 games same idea if you come out of here, you're looking at 242 games. So let's say we're somewhere around five, 600 games right now. Still lots. Uh, fighting, 111 games. So let's say we're somewhere around 700 games. And uh, puzzles, 229. So let's ballpark it around 1,000 games. Okay? Uh, that's short of 4,700 games. So I was like, hmm, okay, I'm curious now. So they do have this one here, which is folder. Just folder. And folder has... As you can see it load here, this is 3,800 games. This is where it kind of makes sense because if we saw the other one being somewhere between 900 and 1,000 games, you tacked it onto 3,800, we're at 4,700. 4, so be aware, number one, is that the games that are in those other four categories, right? Sports, puzzle, fighting, direct shooters, um, they're not in here. So this is, it's like they're like, I don't know what, where to put these ones so we'll just we'll just throw the rest all in in a category and just just be done with it uh so you do get lots of games 100 percent again this is the downfall if i want to go to let's say i want to play and i wanted to play super mario uh and i'm going to do this now because this is the game i want to play for for you guys just to show you guys how this works um while i'm talking i can't go up to one and just pop into the other side i literally now have to go through uh, 
3,800 games. Now I can push to the right and she'll jump 100 games at a time. But still, this is going to take a fair bit of time. If you have a lot of time, that's okay. Now the one thing that I did notice is if this is plugged in and you don't unplug it, let's say I got here and this is, I was playing Castlevania and I backed out. When I come back in, as far as I can tell, it will start at that that same area. So it starts, yeah, so it starts there at Castlevania, right? So that's not bad. At least it does that. But a search would have been nice so I could say, or an area at the top that had, you know, A through Z that I could be like, just take me to the to the S's or take me to the M's or take me to the whatever. Right? Uh, lots of games on here. If you're a Nintendo, like a retro Nintendo person, you'll just love all these. And they seem to run really good. It's amazing how, you know, either how powerful this little HDMI stick is or uh, how little power these games really took. The fact that there's 4,700 games and it's a 4 gig card that's in there. So the fact that uh, 4,700 games on a 4 gig card, that's, that's actually pretty good. And see, we're still just sitting here waiting. I would bet, I would think, possibly if you had a faster, maybe a faster micro SD card, maybe it would be able to go through this quicker, just for the fact that it has to load up the list. I'm, I'm just, I'm really just guessing. Ooh, there's, what did I see there? Star Fox. Oh, that was good. We should, we should start with Star Fox. Let's just play, because it was a game that really pushed, kind of pushed it at the beginning, right? Let's, uh, Star Fox USA. Let's try it. Yes? And start. Now, the other thing that you can do, too, when you get in here, and I talked about this a bit in the review, I was like, oh, it shows up widescreen. But again, when games like this came out way back in the day, and I'll just kind of hold these two buttons down, right? If you hold them down, you get this resume, quit, load, save. But you can come in here to screen, and you'll actually see that you can either full screen it, which means that it stretches it out, or you can go to scaling. So in scaling, you would actually see the game, which is probably what I'm going to set it to. Okay, scaling. Um, it it actually has it in its original ratio, which would be like a four by three. So we'll just go back to resume here. We should shrink it back in and see it the way it was designed to be. Right? Push. Look at this. I never play. I never never had this game as a kid. Have it now playing it look at this control a i have no idea boost blaster nova bomb break rolls push start training nope nope no i don't need training training is for suckers okay look at this do i have to go somewhere do i just hit I don't know if you can tell by the audio i really have no idea if the audio is supposed to sound like that or the audio is just not great because it's being emulated because this would be a fairly taxing game i would think oh you see once i chose it it was a little better oh that is having some issues moving that spinning that ball around Ooh man this is you just get sucked right into this Do I hit the this is like when 3d was like new right the audio is not great He's having problems pushing the audio and the video at the same time. Oh, that was like just a cinematic screen. Can you imagine back in the day, you would have been just like, what is happening? This is like living in the future. to shoot something or am I supposed to just go through these? No idea. I think I, this, oh yeah. Did you see? No, I'm going the wrong way. Oh no. I do have a shoot. I'm definitely going to be dying. Oh look, what are these? This is a very hard game to play. Because I don't know what I'm doing. No idea what I'm doing. There's these guys. Look at this guy. They keep walking. I think maybe, maybe. Well, this is more like. There we go. I was hitting the wrong button. 
Come on, now I'm shooting things. Man, I am. Now I'm on fire. Piece of cake. Oh no, 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 no. The other one was the super bomb, I'm guessing. Right? I don't know if I'm supposed to fly around those or if I'm supposed to hit those. Or if something's hitting me now. I don't have any idea. There is definitely some slowdown on this game. I don't, again, I don't know if it was like that at the beginning, but this would be uh, fairly taxing, I would think, on any modern computer, you know. But I'm rocking it out. There's no, no question about it. Uh, I'd say this game would have ran smoother on the go, on the original, for sure. Would be my guess. No, oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. Okay, well, that that's that game. Let's get out of there. Uh, quit. Okay, and go to the game I really wanted. What a Starwing. So that one ran slow. And there was a couple games that I was running uh, during the the review that I was like, I, I don't know if this is is running slow or if it just it ran that way in the original. I just didn't know. Super Mario Collection. Super Mario All Stars. Right, there's a bunch of Super Mario stuff. All Stars Europe, USA, Super Mario, Super Mario, Super Mario Collection. That's where we're going. Let's try that one. Because if you're going to buy a Nintendo emulator, you want some kind of Mario game, yes? Just talking. 1993. Good stuff. Super Mario Collection. Okay, this, this seems. The music at least seems to be on. It's not like having troubles pushing them. Oh, you got all kinds of games. 1985, Super Mario 2, Super Mario USA, Super Mario 3. Again, the, I think you can really tell if the game's having issues if it's playing slow based a lot on the music. So listen to this music, right? It seems to be playing like pretty much at full. So let's go back to the, the good old original and we'll play Super Mario, push, jump, jump, dash and dash. You got jump and dash. Let's, let's just say that's what you get. Jump and dash. All right. Oh, yeah. I haven't played this. I'll die soon. Oh, no, that plays great. Look at that. Good responsiveness. Yes. Very excellent. One of these is gonna pop a mushroom up for me. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that was a fail. I wasn't supposed to do that. Okay. Oh yeah, see this? This is good stuff. Good stuff. You gotta watch these, because that's where the plant guys will come up. Boom! Boom! Fire! Fire pellet guy! Double jump, right? Ready? Look at that. Do I think I can... Oh. Yeah. Come on now. I'm doing. Oh yeah. It's not perfectly smooth, but I'm just giving you guys an idea. It's definitely playable. Without question. Oh. I missed, missed my guy there. Is that it? Did I finish the level? Booyah! Okay. So that one plays good. Music seems to be playing on, on, on point. We're doing okay. Load times. You know, it's like playing off a cartridge. Look at this. Can you imagine these games back in the day? Yeah, when I was young, this was the game I played. And then we come here. Let's pretend we don't want this. So we're going to quit. I wonder if it takes me all the way out or can I get back to the load screen? I have a feeling it's gonna take me all the way out. Yeah, so let's pretend. I just want to go back in here because I want to try one of the, the, the newer ones. So something that was like, I don't know. Not the first Mario, you know? So let's go in here. And we'll go to Super Mario 3. Did we jump from 1985? 19, 
What is this one? Super Mario USA. What is it? 1992. What is this one? Is it the same game? I don't know. It says 1993. Music is still doing okay, which is good. Story. Oh my goodness. Stories and everything. What more do you want? If you want gaming, streaming, game streaming at its finest, boom. Story, you know. Oh, did I miss it? Oh, I get to even choose. Oh, yeah, I'll be Mario. Extra life, five. Oh, you can even choose how many extra lives you can get. Oh, this is... I don't know what's happening. Oh, I, I didn't do well at all. Oh, I can't kill these guys? But it runs smooth. Check that out. Right? And I think I push up to go through this door. No? Yep. Oh, that's right. I remember this game now. Oh, no. I can pick up... I can pick up radishes and throw the radishes. Is he gonna come through? No! I think I can climb this. Man, back in the day, the graphics were... Get it? What is this? Pow. Oh, it shouldn't be so much fun. I'm gonna die here. Nope, I'm okay. See, games back in the day. Oh, look, the heart. Oh, yeah, I'm rejuvenated. This log thing. Play the first level. No, no. Oh, dead. See, the extra. If you run out of your lives, that's it. Okay, we'll do one more game, and then that'll, I think, maybe be it for today. Because nobody's, nobody's, well, there's people watching, nobody talking. So I am going to uh, find another fantastic game. I wish I were, you know what I wish they had? Maybe they do. Remember, did anybody remember Zaxxon? Remember Zaxxon? My guess is... Donkey Kong. That's weird. Do some, maybe they're just different, different ROMs. Back in the future. I want. Do they have? Oh, what's zero? Isn't they have a racing game? I want Zax. Oh, Zelda would be good. They don't have Zax on. They don't. We're going to Zelda. In Japan. I'm wondering if that means it's going to be. It's there, but for version two. I don't know what any of that means. Let's give her a go. We'll do a Zach. A, but Zaxxon was such a cool game. And I, I per, maybe it was ColecoVision that Zaxxon came out for. Someone should re-release. Re 1991. Okie dokie. Again, music's on par. It's doing all right. Definitely uh, not in a language I can read. We will just be Bob. It was targeting system. Sweet deal. Yep. Uh, it's good, but I can't understand anything that's happening. So uh, I'd say it plays fine, right? If I could figure out or how to read Japanese, which I can't. Apologize. Get out of here. Can't even zip through all this to make it faster. That's sad. What's so sad? Come on now. Oh, here he goes. See, I remember playing this game back in the day, but without having it in English. It's, it's kind of pointless to play, but it plays excellent. Like, movement is fantastic. It's very good. I think I have to go to the front of it to open it. Yeah, I got something. All right. Negative. Can't play it. It makes me sad. 
because not my language. We'll try one more game just to find something that plays. Then, see, there's, it, this has become the issue I find. Oh, Wolfenstein, Wolverine, uh, is that you get so many games, especially when you can't. Like, I'm not even. I don't think I'm seeing them all. Is that? so many games that you're just like I don't know if I'm actually I don't know what game to play Top Gear that seems good right Top Gear USA a good old racing game let's try it out this one will push the limits I'm sure sound is still good Chemco oh yes Chemco Top Gear 1992 Press start Or the A button Whatever oh, I can check my player, my skill level Amateur yeah. 100% Country USA, South America They don't have a lot of options here All the USA is close Speed, kilometers per hour, play game there definitely feels like maybe there's a little bit of slowdown, right? Music's fantastic. Make you strong, make you tough, right? Well, that's that's something. I kind of want to play one more game. Teenage Mutant. Yeah, and Turtles, Turtles in Time. It's it's European, which means that it would possibly be in a language I could understand. They all came out kind of the same time, right? 1992. Konami. Oh yes. I think this one maybe was a side scroller, kind of like uh, Final Fight. Final Fight? That one? Oh, I think I did play this one. Check that out. Heroes in a half shell. Dark power, bottom, bottom. Four. Player. Cowabunga! Cowabunga. Oh, I have to. Has to happen again. I don't know what the buttons do, but that's okay. Okay, there's April O'Neil. 
and somebody stealing the staff delivery. That's cool. I like that when the graphics were up close. They were just a small graphics, just zoomed in, so they were like so pixelated. <laughs> oh, it's fantastic. Oh, retro games. Big Scene Apple, one. 3 a.m. But I had talking. Hear that? Big Apple, 3 a.m. Do I have to hit a button? Maybe. Oh, yeah. Jump. I think it was just jumping that. Ready? Yeah, yeah this is just like Final Fight. Final Fight? Is that what it was called? Totally playable, though. Yeah. Yeah. I bet if I got close to one, it's throw. Ready? If I can get close to it. There you go. Oh, you threw him at the screen. That's excellent. There's some blue balls. Oh no, oh no. Yeah. Suck it. Whoa, I didn't realize that. The ball changes where it actually is. Yeah. Nope, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Is that pizza? Yes, pizza time. Pizza, pizza time. What? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh no. You can get that. That's gonna blow up. Yes, sir. Oh no, that's not fair. So if you hit both buttons, you get that spinny thing. Yeah. All right, I'm I'm enjoying myself. Oh no, he's out throwing stuff. Ready? Oh, again, I'll play till I'm dead, because this guy's getting, there he is, he's anybody coming out? Tap your foot, that's nice. I like the music, it's just like, oh, that sucks a whole lot. Did I die? I might have died. No, I'm not cool with this guy, whatever he's doing. Yes, sir. Okay, blue balls again. Yes, come on. Where are you coming? Where are you coming? There you are. Yes, no way. Don't let, don't let it happen. Don't let it happen. Dual blades. Dual blades. Yeah. Pretty awesome. So I know. You're all jealous. It's alright. It's fair. I get it. Pizza. It's pizza. Pizza time. Pizza time. Come on, that ball's gonna smash him. White one. Oh man. He's got. Oh, you see that church? Oh no. What is this? Terminate the turtle. You can only tell by the shadows. What's gonna happen? Come on. Come on, get him. There's like games that you just. There's just no way to get good at it, like you actually win it. <laughs> you know, back. <laughs> Come on. Like you were like trying your hardest all the time, and it just, just never mattered. Like, the most this thing is just be, be patient. Like, Doctor, am I supposed to just get away from him here? Maybe, maybe that's the deal. I'm just supposed to stay away from him. Stay away from Oh, I can't stay away. I can't run fast enough. There he is. There he is. Come on, he's dead. Come on, he's dead. Boom! Cowabunga. And you can play as two players. 
that's exciting because you get two controllers. Alley cat this. blue. All right, guys, that's it. It's oh, uh, is it fun? Yeah. Not all the games for sure are gonna run at full speed. For sure, they're gonna you're, you're gonna feel a bit of slowdown. But I would say a good a good uh, a good percentage of them are gonna run you know pretty good good enough to have fun and again i have a i have a coupon code down down at the bottom if you guys are interested from banggood i think you can get this for like 22 dollars. i think it's us so you know that's pretty good if you want to be able to play some retro stuff take it with you you know maybe you have a little portable screen maybe you want to play it on a big screen it doesn't matter you know um yeah it's kind of fun all right my friends uh that's it i just wanted to show you this wonder this uh craziness that is the sf 900 and if you are into retro games and you don't have a lot of money to spend uh it could be a cool option are there better emulators out there yeah for sure i have a bunch of them that but but they're more but they're way more expensive right they're probably closer to 60 80 to 100 uh 20 something to 20 something bucks you know great great for a young kid for sure or someone that just wants to be a just have a blast playing some retro games all right, my friends, that is it for the live. If you want, make sure to head on over to the channel uh, and watch the review video that came out this morning because that'll talk a lot more about uh, the unboxing and, and some info on it. And uh, that's it. I'm going to enjoy my coffee and I will see you guys uh, later on. All right, my friends, have a great one and we'll see you guys uh, tomorrow. Later. <laughs>